and I was like, okay, it's time to just just go in, just go in on it. And I, ah, and I extracted the elite. You gotta work these packs, y'all. If you don't gotta chanter, take notes and work these packs. <laughs> What up, what up, what's going on gamers, it's your boy I Maverick, aka Mr. Let Me Dabble Up In These Packs, though. And we gonna do some more Legend Packs, so we are gonna pull those three individual Legend Packs. But before we do that, let's go ahead and open these little four random packs that we got. Uh, I don't even, I don't even remember where I got all these from. And what I did, I was doing some solo challenges, so that's probably where they came from. Uh, I, I wanted to save the large quick sale pack that we had for this video accidentally opened it in part one of the or part one of this little video thing thing and we got a 20k quick sell which isn't the largest but it's not bad I've heard horror stories of people getting one or two Ooh, I'll take this 500 coin quick sell too so you know what I mean not bad not bad another 500 coin all right Yo, I have never, I have not pulled one elite badge this year. As many packs as we didn't opened, I feel like, dang man, I should at least pull one elite badge. All right, so let's get into it, man. Legend packs. Um, yeah, I won't waste you guys' time with that. I was gonna, I kind of wanted to look and see what legend collectibles I already had. We might do it at the end of this video. So if you want to hang around and see that. Uh, you can do so if not. Uh, we'll just get the pack opening out the way so you can either see that and then keep it moving. Man, I'm not feeling good about these individuals, man. Okay, that's a, that's a decent sale right there. I think that's a decent sale right there. I'm um, looking on Mutthead right now just to. I might even just. I should just put him up right now. Did I spell his name wrong? Oh, yeah. Andy, how do you say that? Levitre, Levit, Levit, Levitre, Levit. Eh, he's going for like. I mean, Mutthead has him at like 25. And I mean, if you want to be like really smart and really thorough with what you're doing, you probably want to double check because sometimes Mutthead uh, will undershoot things. And a few cases, I've actually seen Mutthead overshoot it too. Mutthead just gives you like a a general. A general idea of where it's at but unless it's my elites I usually don't double check yeah man see that's the bad thing like at least we like wifey's not here right now she's out of town so we get to buy these packs freely and don't have to fight for our life but at the same time we're losing a, a, an amazing chanter she has very good chanting skills and um Ooh, ooh, hold on. Let me see your skills. Ooh, 87 pass block. I don't even know if the center I got now is. Oh, I forgot I found him. He was a sleeper. Okay. He was a sleeper. All right. Uh, but see, here's the thing, man. It's very rare. Uh, ooh, he's only going for like 14. Um. It's very rare to have more than one qualified chanter in a household. Uh, usually each household will only have one chanter, but there are rare cases. There are rare cases, but uh, it's been proven that she's the chanter in our household. Uh, so me attempting to chant would just have a negative effect. So I gotta open these packs off of feel. Like I gotta just warm them up the right way. Uh, and you know, I could tell when EA ain't trying to work with me though. I could tell when EA ain't trying to work with me though. Ooh. I think we got three Webster collectibles. So that might not be bad. That might not be a bad look. Okay. Alright. Last one. EA. Let me get that elite though. EA. EA don't do me like this. Should I drop? We gonna... We're going to do points on this one, not coins. 
usually I can tell when I rip the pack open like you can tell when it's gonna be a good one as soon as you rip it but I think I sold all my I'm pretty sure I sold all my Michael Irvin collectibles It was green at first. It was green at first, so it scared me. I was like, ah! and that's why it kind of, it kind of, it kind of tingled and, and threw my senses off a little bit because it was a football outsider and it flashes green immediately. But ooh, but I felt it. I was feeling it out, y'all. I was feeling it out, and I was, I didn't feel good about them first two packs, and I told y'all. But that third one, I ripped it, and some just felt, it, you know, what I mean, I can't really describe it. It was just like a. Okay, okay, so I was feeling it out. I came back, it didn't feel right, so I had to work it back a little bit, work it back, and I paused. And I was like, okay, it's time to just, just go in, just go in on it. And I, ah, and I extracted the Elite. I extracted the DeMarco. You gotta work these packs, y'all. If you don't gotta chanter, take notes and work these packs. I'm working out here, y'all. Oh, I'm working these packs. We gotta compare. I mean, I don't think he's gonna be too much to uh, to green because I like what I have. Oh, hold on now. Let me shut up. Let me sh let me shut up. Let me shut up, bruh. Oh. You ask me, this is a. I think I'd much rather go with DeMarco. Let's see what the catch is. Are you serious? Oh, Amon's getting put on the block now. Amon Green is a really unique combination of, you know, speed. He has the agility. Hold on, Larry. Stay there. Stay there. Hold on. Um, of the agility, but also like the trucking. But we're getting that with DeMarco, and what is DeMarco going for? Uh, Mudhead's got DeMarco going for like 95k. Is Amon, is Amon Green still hot? Uh, last I checked, he was at like around 300k. He drops like 285, so I'm gonna put him on the block now. Because as people are pulling these DeMarcos, everyone's gonna be putting up their Amon Green because it doesn't make sense. And I was just about to do my card review. I actually I have the footage chopped up. I just gotta voice it over for Amon Green. I'm gonna make sure I mention that. That's the thing, you gotta be careful. Sometimes Mudda gets you like that. You'll get caught up with like the legend. But there's usually a cheaper alternative that does the same thing. Like Eddie Lacy and um, uh, Beast Mode. I feel like Eddie Lacy's a very close replica to Beast Mode, but you get them for cheaper. You know what I mean? You got to look at these things. Uh, so that's a wow. Wow, that was, a, that was a really, really good pool there. That was a fantastic pool. And I extracted that pool. Guys, there's, you got to know how to work these packs, man. Now there are there will be times where EA it's not always EA's fault y'all y'all just don't know how to work these packs man you gotta work on your pack working skills uh, how do I and I might fail at this right now but how do I go just by like my legend collectibles all right so we're at collectible um there's no way to do no. No way to do just legend. Okay, so with the legends are gold. Okay. Oh, we got two Mike Webster. Okay. All right, so we're gonna uh, we're gonna end this video here. I'm gonna dabble a little bit, uh, see what these sets are looking like, see if I'm gonna feel like completing any of them. Uh, it might be worth it if I can spend just a little bit of money. Uh, to complete these sets, get the legends, and then maybe sell them for a, uh, you know, a profit. We'll see, though. Uh, I'm not going to bore y'all with all that in this video. I appreciate y'all rocking with me. Uh, had a good time. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for all the support. Y'all be easy. Till next time, God first. God bless.